In the first Metal Gear Solid, Snake has two character designs. The first is his briefing character design, where he's, well, naked, shredded as hell, and has long, bright hair. Before the mission starts, he cuts it and dyes it to avoid being confused with his twin brother Liquid, and after that we get his main design, which is fairly restrained and generic, frankly. It's mostly bland grey colours with very little fluff or flair, and this seems intentional, in part to heighten the contrast with Liquid, but also keeping a protagonist nondescript is actually good for helping the audience project themselves into him and identify with him. Everything iconic about Snake here is what he's wearing, his bandana and his sneaking suit. And bland though the colours may be, it is a cool suit, I have to admit. Yoji Shinkawa's art strikes a really compelling balance between the synthetic and the biological. He maintains much of Snake's musculature through the suit, while at the same time managing to make it look baggy, bulky, and air quotes tactical. It's this mix of Shinkawa's sensuality with Kojima's love for sterile military gear that gives Metal Gear its unique style. And while Snake isn't nearly as interesting as his twin brother as a character design, that is in part the point. Snake has chosen to be a very different man than his twin.